glass container, an actual favorite. Phenomenal. That's the berry. So we just got back from Sephora and I got the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz in the shade Light Brown. Uh, since I don't really know how to use a brow pencil, I got the Brow Wiz so that way I could learn and I could get better at it. I also have never done my brows before so it's also why. But And like I said, it comes with a spoolie at the end which I like how it comes with a cap over it so then it won't get all dirty. Hey guys, good morning. Today we are in New Orleans, Louisiana, and I actually don't really know what we're doing today, so, um, but, update. Second time of me doing my brows. They're very, they're not filled in a lot, but they look pretty natural. Good morning. So, y'all get a little feature of what I do every day. So I took a shower, obviously, because my hair is wet, and I usually just let it dry because I'm too lazy to blow dry my hair and it's all curly. So, anywho, so I actually found out what we did today, yesterday, because obviously we did yesterday. So we went to downtown New Orleans and we walked all along the streets and we had really good po' boys. And we then, went to this jazz festival thing where they had all these people playing jazz and there was it was really cool because they were all adults and there was this one little boy there playing the trumpet and it was really cool. Um, and they had a whole bunch of food and stuff and then we went to a really cool restaurant called The District and we went there for dinner and I got two um, Kaloshis, yes. So like they're like pigs in a blanket, but they just call them Kaloshis in the south. So they're basically the same thing, but I had two of those because they're like really like that big. But they were really, really good, and their donuts look amazing. We had the cheesecake donut. It was like strawberries and then cream cheese, cream cheese filling, and then it had a strawberry icing at the top with a strawberry on the very top. But, and then we went to Lush and I actually bought absolutely nothing. I got a million samples. So, if you know me, I love free stuff and I will do anything for anything free. Not quite literally, but I will. Um, so we went to Lush and I know that you can get as many samples as you want, so I obviously... I'm just gonna say one thing real quick. Lush used to have these really tiny bottles that they would do their samples in and they were great for the balm and like to, just to reuse them so I would always reuse them and I'm really thankful because they made them a lot bigger and they are legit a hundred times larger like look at that they are just really big so they changed the size of it so you get more product from their samples and you could use them for bigger items like trinkets or whatever very very hot here in Louisiana but anywho I got the happy hippie shower gel and this stuff smells really good and they got it in the big pot so I have extra. I've had a sample that I've had for almost a year and it lasts me that long and I don't actually I didn't really use it every day probably that's why because I have big bottles but it's a really long time. So next I got tea tree gel so it's like something to put on acne and it'll help because 
I got some acne. I got the Rosy Cheeks Face Mask. Uh, it says rosy face, but it's rosy cheeks. And this kind of helps also with acne, and it's a pink face mask. I don't know if you're supposed to refrigerate it. I think you were supposed to, but it was very cold last night, so it's all good. And then I also got a sample of their soap. It was the Maypole. Here's what it looks like. It kind of reminds me of a reversed watermelon. But it smells really good. And it's May Pole, not Maple. But it sounds a lot alike. And again, I cannot read what it says, but it is another face mask. It's the Warrior face of mask. I just can't read the first word. But yeah, this one, I think all the face masks go in a smaller one because they're supposed to be used once and it works. So yeah. And I just want to be real, real with you guys real quick. I am using my phone in the Instagram app using the focus setting. That's why everything's blurred out so well. I do not have a vlog camera. I will be getting one after I'm done getting all the tack for my horse and then a actual filming camera because the one that I'm using now, it's my mom's, but it doesn't have the screen that flips out so I can see myself. So right now I'm just using a mirror on top of it. So I'm gonna get that first for all my main channel videos because my phone works well for vlogs. And then I'm going to get the vlog camera that has the screen that also pops out and yeah. So that's basically what I'm going to be doing for getting my vlogging stuff. Mary's an armadillo. It's running away. Will it roll? Just be you.